Atlanta Plugged In starts now. Now that the seasons are changing, it's the perfect time to get ready for cooler weather. HGTV star Matt Blashaw is teaming up with Energy for Everyone to give us tips to prepare our homes for winter. Thanks for joining us, Matt. Why is fall a good time to get a heating system checked? Yeah, now is the ideal time. You don't want to be in the middle of winter having a maintenance person come trudge through the snow to get to your issue. So why is it important now? Well, the weather experts, including the Farmer's Almanac, they are saying that it's gonna be a very cold and wet winter. What does that mean? Staying inside more, uh, being with friends and family, being next to a roaring fire, and all this, all this can be done with propane, and that's why we call propane an energy source for everyone. October 7th is National Propane Day, so we can talk all things propane and keeping your family comfortable and warm this winter time. So what are a few heating maintenance tips that we should do right now? So right now, open all your air vents, all your registers is what they call them in the house. Sometimes you close them down during the summertime. You want all of that warm air circulating throughout the house. A lot of people don't replace their air filter on their furnace for eight months to a year. You might be doing that every month to three months during the, the, the peak of the winter season. The more you change out your filter, the more air that will go through it as well as it will extend the lifespan of your furnace. Do you have any tips for saving on heating costs? Yes, install a programmable thermostat. I use one that's Wi-Fi enabled. My wife and I are at work, my son is at school. It brings the house down to about 55 degrees and then right before we come back, it gets our house up to about 67, 68 degrees. It's gonna save you a lot of energy costs and also your utility bill puts a lot of money in heating your water. So set your tanked water heater to about 120 degrees. Anything over that is gonna be a little excessive. Or maybe plan on upgrading your system to a propane-powered tankless system. Much like not heating your home when you're not inside of it, that tankless water heater will not heat your water until you need it. Those are great tips. Thanks, Matt. For more information, head to propane.com.